Hey y'all, welcome back to Yellow Texas. So when you're hungry, there are fewer things that are better than a good old fashioned burger, side of fries and a thick shake to top it off. Follow that with banana split and I'd say you have yourself an all American classic. Well, our next destination is known for serving up some of the best old school eats in the entire state with the side of nostalgia with every bite. So we sent our resident tech expert JB to Bernie to check out the ultimate 50s dining experience. Welcome to Soda Pop's Patio Grill and Bar. Open in 2010 in the heart of Bernie's charming historic district, Soda Pop's Patio Grill and Bar is taking retro to a whole new level. They've got menus stocked with classic comfort foods, a sugar shack filled with amazing desserts, and a vintage game room offering plenty of old school fun. The best part? This hopping burger joint also hosts a hot rod show two Saturdays every month, bringing in some of the coolest classic cars this area has to offer. And at the heart of this classic car scene is this amazing hot rod garage owned by Stacy and Maurice Andrews, just a little way down the road. Let's head inside and take a look at some of the cars. Yeah, I mean, this place is pretty cool. I, I think I would enjoy coming. Do you like coming to work every day? Absolutely. This is my retirement place right yeah. here. Why are you interested in cars in the first place? So it's always been a passion for me. I mean, you, and the neatest thing that I like about the older cars versus the new is the mechanical aspects. Most modern cars, you know, they're electronic devices. Older cars are mechanical devices that we can still play with and tinker with, and I enjoy that. I don't imagine that you just do all this by alone, is that correct? No, I have a pretty much a dream team out here. Basically, we're all the same age, we have similar backgrounds, and those backgrounds all come to a head here, and it gives us the skill sets to be able to do the best work that you can get anywhere on classic cars, muscle cars, and hot rods. On top of the hot rod shop, I know you guys also have the restaurant down in, in uh, Bernie called Soda Pops. Soda Pops, yeah. And there's something special happening tonight, correct? There is. It's Hot Rod Night at Soda Pops. We built a 50s-style hamburger store on a corner in the historic district. Later on, we actually took the building next door and turned it into an old-fashioned soda fountain, ice cream parlor, gift shop, and it's a gathering place. And so tonight, is Hot Rod Night, which we've been doing for eight years. We'll have live music down there tonight. There'll be hundreds of cars. There'll be thousands of people. It's gonna be a lot of fun tonight, for sure. So I'm here in front of Soda Pop's Patio Grill and Bar. I'm already loving the vibe. I'm really looking forward to chasing down the smell of great food inside. So this is my first time here. Okay. What do you recommend on the menu? The Magnum Burger. It's okay. huge. It's almost a pound. It has green chili, jalapenos. It's loaded. It's a pound? It's almost a pound. Okay. Uh, I think I can try to handle it. Alrighty. Awesome. And that drink for you? And the drink. Yeah, okay. that'll do it. Y'all called 30? Yes. Awesome. Woo! Looking forward to this one. You need a fork. Uh, yeah. Do most people eat it with a fork? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Just yeah. Let's get all the, all the good stuff. All the good stuff? Yeah. This looks like it's a, a bit of a project. So on any good project, like uh, when you're rebuilding a hot rod, you need a few tools. So I've got these to deconstruct this. Some lubricants. I'm gonna see what I can do about trying to eat it without having to dice into it. All right, let's tackle it this way. I'm a pretty big fan of this one. Once the hot rod started rolling in, I had to go check them out. We have a 1961 Corvette. It's a 67 Pontiac GTO. 57 Chevy Bel Air two-door hardtop. It's a 66 Ford Mustang. <laughs> to cooling down with something cold to eat and a little bit of air conditioning. So, been walking around checking out the hot rods. Now I'd like something sweet. I think you guys have, looks like malts and uh, cookies, but you guys have ice cream, correct? Yes, ice cream, eight different flavors. Okay. And can I put the ice cream in these bowls here? Yeah, these are actually our uh, homemade waffle bowls. Okay, uh, can we do a Sunday in one of those? Yeah, we can do a Sunday. Great, let's do that. All right, there's 
a hot fudge sundae for you. Sweet. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Really enjoyed checking out those sweet rides, but now I'm really looking forward to this sweet ice cream. That is sweet. What about Hot Rod Night brings you out? Oh, this is a great environment. It's a great venue. Reminds me of the years when I was growing up. People are great out here. It's a great venue. A lot of different cars. Very family friendly. As you can see, you can bring any kind of muscle car, old, new. This adventure's been one of my favorites. Between the good food, the good music, and the classic cars, it doesn't get more American than that. Big thanks to Maurice and Soda Pops for having us out. See you all around Texas. Want to experience Hot Rod Night at Soda Pops for yourself? Just visit the link below to learn more.